Hi everybody! Time for another episode of The Good, The Bad, and The Utterly from the Danny app. This is episode 7. Wow, time flies. We are in April. So, uh, trying something a little different this week. Got myself a handy new little camera so I can move about my room to uh, share things with you now. And uh, behind me is my, my yard sailing table. So we'll get to that in a minute. But uh, first, uh, just to recap, it's spring, finally. Got a little weeding done. Went to a little wholesale trade show. Did a meetup meeting. You know, not much. <laughs> Actually, it was a crazy week. So I uh, had my first experience going to the ASD um, trade show. And what this is, is a convention where wholesalers, distributors, manufacturers all come to one place. Uh, about 5,000 vendors were there. And then those of us who are in the resale market go there and find new products to sell and uh, different ideas for the, the coming quarters. So I made some really good connections, really excited. i uh, got tons of catalogs of different wholesalers as I kind of dive a little bit more into wholesale and depth of inventory, uh, which is really a time saver to keep the money flowing. But I did something really exciting. Uh, thanks to my dear friend, Diva Dawn, who uh, also lives here in Las Vegas. She introduced me to this whole uh, ASD Thing and uh, went with her and met up with a couple other friends, Cindy Hamilton, hi Cindy, and Gary and, and Patricia Turner, hi Gary and Patricia, uh, had a great time and I actually ended up buying out a booth. What these vendors do a lot of times is they bring all the stuff with them and at the end of the show they need to get rid of it. So instead of packing it all up and taking it home, they will sell it even at a little cheaper than wholesale to somebody uh, like myself coming to the show. So I, I bought out a booth that contains all of these hand-carved marble figures. Now this is Fred. Um, Fred, as you can see, is kind of large-sized, weighs about 16 pounds. Um, he's all hand-carved marble. He has a stand that attaches to him, too, so it looks like he's swimming. So I bought out about 160 pieces. Um, I only have one other one that's as big as Fred. The rest of them are um, smaller sizes, much easier to ship. And I paid about $1,200 uh, for the entire inventory. Um, this is even 15% below wholesale costs. And I will see which ones sell the best and then plan on ordering more and doing more business with this company. So that's really exciting. Fred was heavy. Whew, got me out of breath. Um, the other thing that I've been doing uh, this past couple of weeks is going yard sailing again. Spring is here, everybody's doing their spring cleaning, and the yard sales are going full force. So I had some really exciting um, finds at the last couple of yard sales, and um, one of which was these taxidermy pheasants. Now you might think it's just a stuffed bird. Yes, it is just a stuffed bird. Uh, but these sell really well. And I had a lady who uh, wanted 25 for the pair, and I talked her down to 20 for the pair. So they came home strapped in my kids' car seats. Um, haven't quite got those listed yet, but they will go up and should bring about $100 each. Let me back up just a second. When I was at the trade show and I bought this booth, I needed the money in my PayPal account to, to do this transaction. And I didn't, I didn't have as much as I needed, so I actually made a quick call uh, to Cabbage because I didn't have my computer with me. And um, the wonderful, wonderful people at Cabbage.com uh, were able to help me get that money into my PayPal account within 10 minutes and I was able to do my transaction. Um, I can't say enough good things about Cabbage. They are an incredible resource for uh, online sellers and uh, there is a link from the dannyapp.com um, if you want to go check them out and, and hear my story about what Cabbage has done for me and how I've utilized them. Happy to share that. Um, so I actually found some crazy stuff at yard sales. 
um, this past uh, couple weeks, and one of which is it's swimming season, so what better than a swim cap that turns into a toiletry bag? These are just so cool. Um, they are imported from Germany, very well made, and I found out that they retail for 30 bucks. So I actually used my own UPC as I had several of these and I sent them into Amazon FBA and uh, got them priced at $19.99. Heck, got nothing to lose. They were a quarter a piece. I'll let you know how that goes. I had a daughter with a birthday this week, so I wanted to say happy birthday, Jordan. Uh, I no longer have a teenager. She just turned 20, and uh, many of you out there know Jordan, and I uh, know she's kind of been doing the eBay thing off and on with me, and I'm happy to announce she just called me this morning and told me that she's going to start her eBay business back up again. So now, both of my daughters will be selling on eBay, as well as my mom. So we are a multi-generational eBay selling family. Uh, that just tickles me because I have worked so hard at doing this business and now I'm able to get back and help them have streams of income too and that's just exciting to me. So we're going to keep this one short this week because it's a holiday weekend. Easter, happy Easter everyone. Happy spring and uh, no Ask the Danny App show on, on this Sunday uh, in, in honor of Easter. And there are plenty in the archives. If you've missed any of the shows, it's a good time to catch up if you have nothing better to do. Lots of good information on every show, I assure you. And please send in your questions for, for upcoming shows. Love to have those questions. And there's something exciting now. Um, on the Danny app, we have now opened the registration for the uh, sourcing and selling workshops that will be happening after the eBay radio party in June and I'm only allowing five people per day on the Friday and Saturday after the event uh, of the, the eBay radio party uh, we are gonna go sourcing whether that be yard sales thrift shops estate sales you know whatever lines up and whatever uh, you guys want to go do we're gonna go do that get you to stretch out of your comfort zones get things you wouldn't normally buy to list kind of develop some new instincts on things to buy and then we're gonna go back in, in front of the computers and we're gonna get those items listed in the absolute best way possible we're gonna I'm gonna teach you how I research and find things and use the keywords and I guarantee you it's going to be a profitable day. So don't miss out on that. Go on over to the dannyapp.com to the workshops page and get signed up if that's something you're going to be in Las Vegas and able to attend. Other than that, I'm going to have more great stuff coming this week. Uh, there's so much happening and I'm going to bring it all to you as it happens and I'm going to share with you the great scores. And we're just going to have a load of fun because that's what it's all about. Thanks everybody. See you next week.